This is the first time that an agreement was coming for ratification that it had not been executed. In other words, it had not been signed. Our contention is Article 75.2 is very clear that this agreement ought to have been executed. It ought to have been signed before coming to Parliament. I submit to you that the agreement with Joy FM presented through its platforms, which went viral, which the President has been concerned about, is premature presentation to you or leak to you, is the same agreement which has been ratified by Parliament. And this cannot be contested. Before the Gitmo 2 decision last year, the view that the executive have taken, the executive arm of government, is that these agreements do not require parliamentary ratification. And all of us under President Rawlings, President Kufour, President Mills, are all guilty. And what President Akufuado failed to add is that the 1998 agreement came into force in March 2000. It was operationalized under his watch as Attorney General. If he feels so strongly that he's always been the champion of transparency and all of that, why didn't he bring it to Parliament for ratification? The 1998 agreement has portions which says that while in Ghana, however, the United States Armed Forces shall pay reasonable charges for services requested and received. You don't find this in the, in the, in the 2018 agreement. There's another portion in the 1998 agreement which says such aircraft shall observe local air traffic control regulations while in Ghana. There are so many aspects in this, in this agreement, the 1998 agreement, where Ghanaian law is respected. In the current agreement, Ghanaian law is ousted. International law is ousted. Page 4 of the current agreement, sorry, of the 2015 agreement, which I hold in my hands, I read Article 4. The following items are not eligible for transfer under this agreement and are specifically excluded from its coverage. Weapon systems, guided missiles, naval mines and torpedoes, nuclear ammunition, guidance kits for bombs or other ammunition, chemical munitions or ammunition, and it goes on and on and on. You don't find that in the 2018 agreement.